The CDATA Power BI connector provides self-service integration with Microsoft Power BI, linking your Power BI reports to real-time data. In this video, we walk through getting started with the CDATA Power BI connector by installing the connector and using the built-in DSN configuration wizard to create a DSN. This video features the CDATA Power BI connector for Salesforce, but the principles apply to any of the 200 plus data sources we support. To begin, navigate to cdata.com slash Power BI and download the Power BI connector. Run the installer and follow the instructions for installation. Once the connector is installed, the DSN configuration wizard will open. Fill in the required connection properties. Test the connection to ensure that you have configured the connection properly. If you have questions about the connection properties, refer to the help documentation. Once you have the DSN configured, open Power BI Desktop. Click Get Data, then Other, then CData Salesforce. Enter CData Power BI Salesforce in the Data Source Name menu. Next, select a Data Connectivity Mode. Select Import if you want to import a copy of the data into your project. You can refresh this data on demand. Otherwise, select Direct Query if you want to work with the remote data in real time. Click OK. Next, choose Anonymous Authentication and click Save. Then, choose a table from the navigator and click Load. After pulling the data into Power BI, you can create data visualizations in the report view by dragging fields from the fields pane onto the canvas. And that's all you need to create a data visualization in Power BI using CData's Power BI connector. To get started with CData Power BI connectors, visit cdata.com slash Power BI and download a free trial. Thanks for watching, and as always, you can find more resources at cdata.com.